So the topic I chose today was dog adoption. I'm a very big activist for dog adoption, partially because I got my dog Carmen from Animal Welfare in Chicago. So many dogs that are abandoned and left by their families that really need homes and are just placed into shelters. I'm really against buying pets from pet stores because most of them come from puppy mills, and puppy mills are unsafe breeding environments where dogs are kept in small places and treat, mistreated just for money. Breeders don't care about the dogs, they only care about the money that they make from them. So today I'm going to ask a couple of my friends about the dog adoption and see if they know the truth about dog adoption and breeding in America. So this is Maggie. Nervous. So this is my friend Courtney. She's got a very good video today. Hi Jason. Hey, what's up? Courtney and I have been to the Humane Society and it's really a great place. Like, if you don't want to adopt a dog, like, you can go and just play with dogs or cats or like whatever kind of animal you want to. And it's a really great, like, it's a really great stress reliever and it's really great for the animals as well. Um, yeah, I think it's a really like good thing for people to adopt dogs that might have been strays or um, dropped off by their owners. So I think dog adoption is a good thing. Uh, well, I think dog adoption is really good because all dogs should have a really good home and I'm a really big dog lover. I don't have a dog, but I've been around dogs my entire life. Basically everyone in my family has some kind of dog and my aunt trains them so when I do like get an apartment or my own house or whatever I do plan on getting a dog um, but at the moment I don't have a dog. <laughs> I don't have a dog. Um, I think eventually I will get a dog but I'll probably adopt it uh, from a shelter. I think that's the right thing to do. I do not have a dog right now but I really do want to get a dog when I'm older so when I have my own place I will have my own dog. And where would you get it from? Um, well, one of my friend's parents actually knows a breeder, so it's from them. Or shelter! <laughs> um, not a lot, but I do know that, like, it's, it's really bad. Like, they don't, they're not very hygienic, like, dogs have all kinds of diseases, and it's not a very good place, like, to be raising puppies and to be continuing breeding them, so they're bad. I think I've heard of them. Um, I know they're bad, but I really don't know what they are. Puppy mills, they're really just, they breed the dogs over and over, and that's really just the point of it. They don't care about the dogs at all. One of my friends actually has a, a dog from a puppy mill, and it's deaf, so you can tell they don't take care of the dogs at all. I think that it's better to adopt them from a shelter, but I wouldn't say that it's necessarily wrong. I think that a shelter is a better idea because there are dog there are plenty of dogs out there that need love that haven't been shown any love. No, I don't think it's wrong, um, but I do think adoption is the best option. Um, well, if it's really just from a puppy mill, I think that is pretty bad, but some places actually do take care of their dogs, and so if they do, then I think it'd be fine, but otherwise, no. When I've been to the shelter, the shelter dogs are just so happy to see people and they just want love and like you just have to like you just have to love them. Like seriously, you can't walk into walk into the room and see them without being like, Oh, I want to adopt you and you and you. It's it's really a great experience and like shelter dogs are so sweet. I think shelter dogs can be like really, really adorable and they might like be barking a lot or be um, kind of rough, but they just never really had a loving home, so I think I think they deserve one. Um, shelter dogs, I think that's actually really good for people to adopt them because they deserve to have a second chance. And if they were kicked away from their family, I really think they deserve a second chance to have a good home and everything. Thanks, Maggie. You're welcome. <laughs> Thanks, Courtney. <laughs> Thanks, Jason. No problem. So you have it. You can see through all of my interviews that they are very for adopting dogs from shelters, so next time you go look for a pet, please consider shelter dogs instead of buying a dog from a pet store.